Hi dear viewers, welcome to English Funda Kolkata. I am Adam Chad. Today we are going to discuss about a very important matters of spoken English. Durga Puja. So in front of me, a student of Bright Abakas Singur, and he will tell about Durga Puja. Okay, first introduce yourself and tell about the greatest festival, Durga Puja. Okay. Hello friends, I am your friend Kola Sajra, a student of level 8 of Bright Abakas Academy Singur. So friends, today we are going to start a video on the topic of Durga Puja. According to the Hindu religious book or Quran, we know that there are almost 33 crores of God and Goddess. But friends, did you know that it's not true? Because there is a story behind this. There is not 33 crores of God and Goddess, there are only 33 God and Goddess. Once upon a time, there was a foreigner historian who was a uh, who discovered a Hindu religion's book. Then he start to read this and uh, start to get information from this. But he did not know Sanskrit very well. So, uh, uh, but he do, uh, he do as he well. Did. He did. He did as well he, he can. Then he translated our line. He translated that there are 33 Koti God and Goddess in the Hindu dharma. He translated Hindu all, religion. Hindu religions. He translated all the lines, but he did not translate the meaning of Koti. Then yeah. he uh, find a simile word uh, that matched with that word. It is Koti. Then he uh, translated that there are thirty three crores of God and Goddess. But friends, the real meaning of Koti it's not crore. The real meaning of Koti means superior. Superior means mighty and powerful. Mm. So from now, if anyone asks you there are how many God and Goddess in the Hindu dharma or the Hindu religion, you only say there are 33 superior God and Goddess, not 33 crore. Okay. So friends, let's jump into our today's topic. That is Durga Puja. In Hindu religion, we celebrated many festivals like Ganesh Chaturthi, Bajrang Bali, Lakshmi Puja, Saraswati Puja and many more. We pray to them to get blessings from them and make our life more better. Mm. Every god and goddess have a, uh, uh, have a responsibility for our uh, earth. Like the Saraswati is the goddess of education, Lakshmi is the goddess of uh, wealth and many more. Like that, the greatest festivals of Hindu is uh, Hindu and Bengali is the Durga Puja. Durga Puja. There was a story that once upon a time there uh, was a very ugly and evil beast called uh, Yam Mahisasu. Mahisasu. Okay, okay. Called Mahisasu or the evil that faced like the. Uh, Mahis or the bull, mm. he can change his uh, face suddenly, instantly into bull, and then he can also converted his body into man. Uh, he is very evil. Uh, one day he uh, owned the throne of the heaven and made the king of the heaven. So the all god and goddess came to Brahma, the creator, and then Brahma and all the god and goddess created a goddess. Are named her Durga. Uh, then Durga, uh, the great uh, greatest goddess of the Bengalis, killed Mahisasur, and from then we celebrated Durga Puja. Mm. There are ten days in this Durga Puja. Aye. People believe that from the first day, Durga uh, goddess Durga came from Kailas and mm. live uh, and stay with her for few days and give us blessings and love. The first day we called Mahalaya means mm. that day when Goddess Durga killed Mahisasu. Mm, yeah. uh, then uh, Prathami, Ditya, Tritya, Chaturthi on the first, second, third and fourth day is like not important like mm. that. Mm. But from the sixth day you can see the magic. The, there are many pupils came, went to many pandals, see mm. the Goddess Durga uh, and uh, spend time with their friends and family. Actually, uh, in the, I am also enjoying this Durga Puja very much. I am also going to many pandals with my friends and family. 
uh, stay with them for a very long time at night and also even in day. At the Ashtami, we eat uh, non veg food, and the Navami and the Sami on the 9th and 10th day, we eat chicken or mutton in non veg food. Mm -hmm. But, friends, there is a problem mm -hmm. that we celebrated Durga Puja by uh, using many uh, by curve. We celebrated Durga Puja to get blessings from the uh, goddess, uh, god and goddess. But uh, there is a word that we. Um, get blessings we pray to the invisible god but we destroyed the visible nature we do, did not know that the visible nature is the real god we destroy we cut down the trees using them to make pandals and mm. decorated our pandals what is really harmful for our environment mm. and uh, even that we also decorated the pandals with many lights so for that uh, the government, the electricity department, the uh, they have to burn uh, a huge quantity of coal which produce CO2 and many other gases which is uh, one of the reasons of global warming. So yeah. from now, uh, please the friends enjoy this Turka Puja. Uh, not in, destroying the nature. Not destroying the nature. In, the, in these 10 days, if every viewer if every indian if every bengali planted a tree uh, in these 10 days only one tree so we can see a really big change from now so enjoy this durga puja with responsibility and fun and also even uh, wear masks because the corona did not go from, go went from us so we have to uh, make some steps so we can also celebrate this Durga Puja on the next year or else we have to stay at home at the lockdown period for our own unresponsibility. Yeah. So friends, irresponsibility. irresponsibility, irresponsibility. Yeah. So on behalf of English Fanda Kolkata, thank you very much for explaining the reason of Durga Puja. Hope this video will help young generation how to speak in English and the young generation will properly learn the meaning of Durga Puja. Thank you again on behalf of English Fanda Kolkata and please like, share and subscribe our channel English Fanda Kolkata and also click the all notification bell to see more interesting videos of our channel. Bye friends, we will meet with you on a next interesting video for that time. Stay home, stay safe, enjoy Durga Puja with responsibility. Thanks for watching. Thank you.